In this video, we're going to teach you how to keep a good tension on the track. The first step is going to be to figure out if you need to add any tension to your tracks. To uh, give you a reference, uh, this is a track uh, where you need to add tension. As you can see, uh, there's approximately a one inch uh, gap in between the rubber track and the wheels. So you can see the difference. Uh, this is a track that is tightened correctly. Uh, as you can see, there is no gap in between the track and the wheels. The first step is going to be to loosen uh, the bolts on the shaft of the front wheels. After, we're going to loosen the bolts that are uh, for the adjustment of the snow deflector. And uh, the M10 bolt uh, that is used uh, for the tensioner of the scraper. Now we're going to proceed to the tightening of the track. What we recommend is to apply a torque of 40 foot pounds on the cam uh, that is used to tighten the track. The way to proceed is to tighten one notch at a time on each side. Now we do the one on this side. It is starting to have a little more tension. As you can see, uh, we're applying a 40 foot pounds. This is what is telling us that we need to stay at the one, two, three, four, five, fifth notch on the cam adjuster. Now our track has the right tension. So now we're going to verify how many notches there is on the track tensioner. So there is one, two, three, four, five notches. And uh, every second notch there is on the track tensioner, you're going to have to move uh, one notch on the tensioner uh, of the scraper. So here we have uh, two notches, one, two. So move to the first position. And then three, four, you should be on the second position. But in this case, uh, we are on the fifth notch, so uh, you're in between five and six, so you have to adjust it to the third notch on the scraper. We do the same thing on the other side. So now the next thing uh, we're going to need to do is come readjust uh, the adjustment uh, on the snow deflector. You're going to want to leave uh, approximately in between uh, the rubber track and the deflector uh, approximately uh, a quarter inch. Now uh, we have put the right tension on the track, we have adjusted the scraper, uh, we have uh, repositioned the snow deflector, and uh, all we need to do is uh, tighten all the nuts.
the last thing we need to do is apply uh, here a torque of 80 foot pounds and uh, right here a torque of 40 foot pounds. So next time you need to adjust the track, uh, you'll notice here you're on the fifth notch. You're going to have to repeat the same procedure at the rear and uh, try to balance it equally on each side and always keep a difference in between both of them in between uh, two to three notches.